episode five of the Milwaukee Admirals trivia show. We have two returning teams uh, on your left. You will see Heather and Sarah. You guys know their uh, titles. And on your right, you will see Brian and Ryan. We call Ryan Soup. Um, we'll start with Heather and Sarah. How is it going? Great. So good. That's great. Uh, Brian and Soup, how are you guys? Great. Happy to be back. I'm a little sad that there's no like intro music yet on episode five. That seems like the next progression. Well, I can, I'll, I'll send you my uh, demo and see which ones you like. And I like it. Mm-hmm. Um, episode five, I normally give everyone the categories and stuff before. I didn't do it this time. Very ill-prepared. We'll see what happens. I'm feeling really good about this. Rules are the same. Uh, 20 seconds per question. I'm going to be harder on that. We're going to make this a nice, tight show. Um, like Sarah always says, would, would Bob Barker do that? I don't know. Um, incorrect answer. Our time expires. Other team will have 10 seconds. Swearing is bad. Don't look up the answers, even though I might have shown you guys the answers before. So we'll see what happens. Uh, you will hear this after a wrong answer. And this after a correct answer. That's good production. Are you guys ready? So ready. Yes. Ready. So ready. Goosebumps. Let's go. Goosebumps. Cool. Um, all right. Question one. We'll go to team one, and that is Heather and Sarah. Um, we always start out with uh, Milwaukee Admirals trivia. And question number one is, which rookie led the Admirals in scoring during the 2019-20 season? Pitlick, Davies, Novak, Wilkins. I'm a last name guy. I'm only going to put names that I can pronounce. 20 seconds, go. Heather, I'm, Heather, I'm uh, reverting to you for this one. I'm going to go with C. C, Tommy Novak, to lead the Admirals and goals during the 2019-20 season. <laughs> you hate to see it. Ooh. Oh, my God. <laughs> Other side. I thought that was the answer, Soup. I, I would. I, you, do you know? I'm leaning either towards Pitlick or Wilkins. Um, or Davies, I'm, I'm guessing. Yeah, that's, that's or, the other uh, Yeah, right. But in this case, I'm leaning towards one of those two. Um, I'm going to go D. D. Josh Wilkins, final answer. <laughs> in over two. <laughs> Rem Pitlick, 20 goals. 2019-20 rookie. Leader for the Admirals with 20 goals. Ouch. Uh, question number two. Other side. Which rookie led the Admirals in assists during the 1920 season? That's Pitlick, probably maybe. Novak. Novak Wilkins. Sorry, I interrupted you. Is no, that, I love does that sound right, Soup? Soup's probably leaning towards C, A, D, or B. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I could see that happening. I, I thought uh, I would say Novak, but you can uh, jump in with anything you'd like. You got five seconds. It's Novak, then. <laughs> okay. We're going with C, Tommy Novak. <laughs> Correct answer. We have one to zero start after the first category. Next up, movie posters. Movie posters. We'll start with Heather and Sarah. Um, 20 seconds on the clock. What movie's poster is this? Million Dollar Baby, Crash, Finding Neverland, Good Night, Good Luck. All right. <laughs> the tension with 10 seconds left. It's not Million Dollar Baby. I don't think it's Crash, but there were two crashes, but it's not the crash I've seen. All right, five seconds. Heather? I got nothing. I don't watch movies. I don't watch movies. Sarah? We will uh, we'll go with D. D, good night. Good luck. <laughs> Incorrect. Other side. B e crash final answer. E crash final answer. E crash final answer. That's crash, y'all. Uh, best picture winning crash. Um, next movie poster, other side. What movie's poster is this? Birdman, Imitation Game, Nebraska, Spotlight. I'm almost positive it's Birdman, but I've never seen it. But I know Michael Keaton's in it, and there's a Birdman on, on it. It's Birdman. <laughs> how, how did they get the last one? It's like, very obvious. 
<laughs> Birdman, final answer. I feel like this game is stacked. Also, last time they, we went first, and we went first this next time also. I don't think I've ever heard anyone complain about going first in anything. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Well, I, feel and, like the, I feel like you're giving them the answers, Colton. Chivalry's dead. I'm sorry. Is this like a ticket department thing? Mm -hmm. Yep. First, they, first they put us off. I think days. you're doing a great job, Colton. Everything seems to be on the straight and narrow. Thank you. I'm sorry. Hand up. That's on me. Ladies go first. Is dead, folks. You heard it here first on Admiral's Trivia. No more of that. Um, I'm sorry. I don't know what to tell you. Next one is science. Over to the two science freaks in Heather and Sarah. 20 seconds on the clock. Which of these were not invented in the United States? Alarm clock, barbed wire, carbonated water, deodorant. Not invented in the United States. <laughs> A lot of confidence. Do you have any ideas, Heather? I don't have any ideas. Uh, do you? I know what it's not. What? It's not B. Okay, I think it's C. Okay, let's go with C. Kay. C, carbonated water, final answer. Oh man, this game is fixed. Oh. This game is fixed, y'all. I still think it's fixed. Colton. Three to one. Uh, halfway through the game, a lot of positive vibes. That's that's what you came here to see, folks. Positive vibes. Twenty seconds on the clock. Um, Soup and Brian. Which of these were not invented by Benjamin Franklin? Bifocals, swim fins, flexible catheter, malt liquor. I uh, only one I know for sure that he did invent was the bifocals. Do you know the other... anything else? Ten seconds. Oh, boy. Swim fins? That sounds like something he... Oh, just go for it. Uh, I don't yeah, care. B, I, swim fins. Let's, let's try it. B, swim fins. Final answer. <laughs> Incorrect. Other side. A, C, or D. Or try B again. Try your luck. Although he loved beer because his favorite... My favorite beer quote is from him... <laughs> that would be my guess, Heather, is D. But uh, you, what do you think? I mean, you know, either C or D. <laughs> In the words of Soup, you know, C or D. <laughs> I got chills yeah, when, you, when you quoted him. <laughs> All right, we'll need an answer. Made it. Did you say it? C or D? I, well, we'll say D. D, final answer. The game continues to be fixed, folks. Since the accusations, a roaring comeback. Three to two uh, after three rounds. I guess halfway we'll we'll do a, a check in. We'll start with we'll start with Soup and Brian. Uh, how, how you guys feeling through three rounds here? Furious. This game is rigged. Just the all right. <laughs> all right. I was a little, you know, thrown off with the accusations, but I thought it was going all right. I'm not accusing you of anything, Soup. The problem is Colton. No, no, no. I know that you weren't accusing me, but, you know, just the accusations thrown at Colton. He put this great show on oh, for us, and he put this on for us. I'll keep that hey, in mind. Come on. So I'm a little about. upset that you didn't know uh, who invented malt liquor. Mm hmm. That, uh, we need but to Apparently, work everyone has their uh, flexible catheter history down, so that's mm -hmm. good. Yeah, that's. That, that was just know. too specific to not be. Yeah, I'd hate, to, I'd hate to live in a world with an inflexible catheter. Oh, my! <laughs> According to the one article I read on Wikipedia, it was wooden before, so... Uh -oh. That's All right, why here we go! All right, later. <laughs> um, next category, MLB. The 1999 Hall of Fame class had three first ballot inductees, which is the most ever. Which of the following was not one of them? George Brett, Nolan Ryan, Don Sutton, Rob Neal. 20 seconds. Whose, whose question is this? Yeah, I don't even know who's... Oh, it's Heather and Sarah. I'm going to... Heather, I'm going to say either A or D, but well, I don't know. Seconds. I also don't know. We will need an answer. D. D, Robin Yount, final answer. <laughs> All right, Soup and Brian. I want to say George Brett and Robin Yount were in the same class because I remember a Miller 
light or something commercial with them in it. So I don't think it's either of them. Obviously, we know it's not Robin Young. Mm-hmm. I want to say Don Sutton. That's my guess. Soup? You'd know more than I would, so I'm going to go with what you say. That sounds awesome. That sounds awesome. Final answer? Uh, Colton, final answer, C, Don Sutton. Wow. Don Sutton is the nice correct job, answer. Dear. Makes it a 4-2 to two game. Last question of round four, Soup and Brian. 20 seconds on the clock. What pitcher threw the last no-hitter at Miller Park, now AmFam Stadium? Carlos Zambrano, Ben Sheets, Chris Carpenter, Alec Mills. I think Carlos Zambrano did it, and not even against the Brewers. He did it against Houston? Yeah. Colorado. Some hurricane yeah. made him play up here or something. Sarah, yeah. quit it. I'd, that that would be the only, that would be my guess. The answer? Yes! I at her. She was! <laughs> Good job, guys! Jeez! <laughs> Are you going with Carl Sobrano final answer? Uh, with uh, Sarah's approval, yep. <laughs> In Carl, <laughs> the mind games. She messed with my head! All right, other side. Sheets, Carpenter, Mills. I didn't even realize you were playing mind games with him, Sarah. Good for me for calling you out. <laughs> that's like that's like double. That's like mind games and stuff. Yeah. Whoa. Carlos Sembrano's signature is inside a locker at Miller Park from that from then, but it's not that. So let's. I don't know, Heather. What do you think? See, Sarah. I don't know about baseball. Nothing. Are we going C, C, final answer? Yeah. Incorrect. Alec Mills of the Chicago Cubs did it last year. Threw it in uh, 2020. All right. Well, going into the final round, the five for fighting round, score is as follows. Heather and Sarah, two, Brian and Soup, four. Uh, you guys know how the final round works. Five for fighting. Each team will have five total guesses. After five guesses from each team, uh, it is over. Points are where they stand. Um, We will go into it with a top ten list of the top ten most streamed original shows in 2020. Uh, We'll give you a clue. There's only one non-Netflix show. Um, So obviously shows like The Office is not a Netflix original or a streaming original so it will be a original piece of content from the uh, streaming network, whatever they're called. Um, Heather and Sarah, you're down two. Are you ready? No. Yep. Oh, yeah. No. Heather, the no first one. Yes. Heather, one of them's got to be Tiger King. Right? Sure. We're going Tiger King with the first guess. <laughs> Correct. Number four. Oh. Three to four. Brian and Soup. I am blanking on Netflix show soup. You got anything in your head? There's still one non Netflix show. Would Ozark be a good? That's that's uh, a Netflix show. Yes, yeah. It's original. Final answer? Yeah. Sure. Number one. Ozark. Right. Okay. Other side. Five to three. Heather? Ideas? Nope. Queen's Gambit? Maybe? Ooh, I don't know if that was 20... I just watched it in 2021. 20... I don't know. Probably not, but I can't think of anything. I'm also blanking on Netflix shows. Alright. <clears throat> Final answer? Yeah. <laughs> I got Other one. Side. How about The Crown? The Crown? Final answer? Yes. Number three. I feel, like you, I feel like you got that one because I said Queen's Gambit. I did, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it is six to three. Um, three guesses for each team left. A mishap by Heather and Sarah, it's over. A correct answer by Brian and Soup, it's over. Going forward. I think it's Heather what and Sarah. Is it? Heather and Sarah, Sarah yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll need it. Oh, oh, what's that one? Uh, what about Peaky Blinders? What about it? Peaky Blinders. What's the deal? Peaky Blinders, final answer for your 
lives in the game? <laughs> nope. Check. Uh, well, to, to boost your career stats on both sides, to help your Hall of Fame candidacy, we'll keep going. Brian and Soup. My kid watched the Big Show show, but I can't imagine that's on this list. <laughs> There's a show called The Big Show? The Big Show show. show. No, I don't. I'm not, that's not a guess. Okay. I'm not. I'm not um, guess. What about. Big Mouth. Sure. That's a cartoon, right? Yeah, that's a Netflix original. People love Final that answer. Stuff. Yeah? Correct. Mm. Heather, lock it up. Heather, what mm. about Letterkenny? Sure. Final answer, Letterkenny. <laughs> Perhaps you could just put all of us out of our misery suit, or uh, Colton, and go ahead. We just yeah, need one fine. more, and it's done. Oh, no, she, they're, they're done now, right? Yeah, you won. Oh. So put us out of our misery and, uh... Well, all right, here, here are the final answers. Does anyone have any final guesses? I'm guessing I'll... the non-Netflix show is either The Boys or Handmaid's Tale. Because those are the only two non-Netflix shows I watch. So it has to be something I watch. Both? Oh, man. They are Lucifer, The Mandalorian is, is the non-Netflix Ah, show. duh. The Umbrella Academy, 20? Great British Baking Show, Boss Baby Back in Business, Longmire, You. I had Mandalorian written down, but I thought that was more recent. I thought that was 2021, because I don't watch it. I was also shocked at the Queen's Gambit not being on there, because that was 2020. Hmm. Well, I'm sorry. Now you know. Now you know, folks. Uh, final score of 6-3. to three. Um, Any, any post-game thoughts? We'll start with uh, Heather and Sarah. Congratulations. Well, yes, I... Congratulations. Thanks, guys. Classy. Appreciate it. Soup, soup. Congratulations to you, Brian. Not, Not so fun. much. Yikes. Soup and Brian. Uh, thank final you. Final words. <laughs> Just positivity all around. Good yeah, vibes. This, this was, was a good time. So much fun. I hope to do it again. Um, and uh, is anyone else 2 0, Colton? You are the first 2 0 contestants. Wow. I just want to thank God, my parents, and, um, you know, thank you for this opportunity. Tears. Tears rolling down my eyes. <laughs> I, I guess I guess down my cheek. Laughing. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, well, that is it, folks. That is the episode. Episode 5. Uh, thank you for joining us. Thank you for the two teams. First 2-0 and team in Admiral's Trivia history. That will eventually be its own Admiral's Trivia question. Um, catch us on YouTube and Facebook. Thank you for, for joining us. Thank everyone else for joining us. We'll see you guys in the next episode.